you want to try this too, or do you, like, is this all me? Leave me a bite. <laughs> I mean, no promises. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, and welcome back to another Daily Hive Vlogmas video. Loren and Andrew here, and we are about to embark on a delicious Christmas chocolate tour. Wait. It's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be amazing. Our All the chocolates. <laughs> All the chocolates. All the chocolates. Luckily, we're both chocoholics, so this is gonna be the best day ever. It's gonna be amazing. And we're gonna show you all the best spots to go for Christmas chocolates in Vancouver. In and around Vancouver, I'll say. Are we? Yeah. Amazing. First stop on our chocolate tour is Chocolate Art in Kitsilano. Chocolate Arts. Been here for 26 red. years? 26 years in Kitsilano. You so you know it's good. A is for Andrew. For awesome Andrew. Oh, sorry, it was awesome not enough for you. No, it's not. <laughs> What do you got there? Um, a couple gingerbread men that aren't gingerbread. Just chocolate. Yeah. Equally delicious. I'm actually not a huge fan of gingerbread, to be honest. Well, then this is good for you. Adorable. Wouldn't mind getting that in my stocking. <laughs> Who sings it? I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. That's a weird thing to ask for, right? In June, pocket days, would you like sh do a bunch of it? If your apartment's too small for a real Christmas tree, or you're not allowed to have real Christmas trees, consider a chocolate Christmas tree. It works. This cute little Rudolph. It's almost too cute to eat, but probably would still eat it. It kind of looks like it's an avocado, but it's not. It's just chocolate. Aww. This photographer's stance. Gotta get that low squat. That's right. <laughs> did they teach you that in film school? That's right, they did. <laughs> this is like literally my favorite kind of chocolate. Oh my god. That's so good. Girls gotta have a chocolate, you know? <laughs> <laughs> right? Oh my god. This is it good? Oh damn, I wanted that one. Mine was really good. Shouldn't have eaten all of yours. Let me get a trade. Oh right, I could have gave you some, I guess. That's fine. I think people take for granted like that we can get like chocolate. You can get chocolate bars at like stores or whatever. And you're just kind of used to like general chocolate, so whatever. Whereas a place like Chocolate Arts actually takes it like a. It's like an art. It's mm -hmm. like. Yeah. Ooh. That ain't no Snickers bar, okay? <laughs> Fancy. There's a lot of chocolate today. I know. And we have two more stops after that. So. Chocolate Alex gets two thumbs up. You heard it here first. Andrew Bartlett <laughs> gives it two thumbs up. Andrew approved. Andrew approved. Yeah. And that's the most important. That's the most important. Ding, Andrew approved. Okay, first stop, done. Now to the next one. And we're gonna eat chocolate till we are stuffed. All the chocolate. <laughs> That's what Christmas is all about after all. Stuffing yourself, apparently. Hit the Christmas tunes. You can input something <laughs> on that, right? <laughs> Okay, stop number two on the tour, Beta 5 Chocolates. Oof, it's gonna be good. They've got a bonkers holiday collection. <laughs> Let's go eat our faces off. These are the, the gingerbread flavored um, part of the holiday collection. Yeah. I was mentioning that they look like glass. But they're just really shiny. These are award-winning chocolates. Here we go. Oh. Oh. Man! 
These are really good. You think I'm faking it, but I'm not. <laughs> These are so good. So good. Like I said before, I'm not like the hugest gingerbread fan, but definitely a fan of chocolate. And this combo is like, oh man, out of this world. Yeah, it's like my only experience with gingerbread is like the houses. <laughs> Those like, but like the cheap, you know, build your own house sort of thing. Right. This this tastes like how gingerbread should taste. I feel. Oh, like your only experience with gingerbread is like when you were eight years old. Yeah. <laughs> building a gingerbread house. That's it. The Christmas cream puffs look insane. This one's uh, the Douglas fir. And they have Mystery Mountain. It's named after Mystery Mountain, AKA Mount Waddington in BC. With a little gold foil on top. And then eggnog and hot chocolate. Love eggnog and love hot chocolate. So just shove both of them in your mouth at the same time. What should I do first? What does your heart tell you? I mean, eggnog, holidays and eggnog. I don't know if you can beat it, so. Go for it. All right, are you gonna, do you want to try this too, or do you want, is this all me? Are you going to eat the entire thing? Probably. Okay, well leave me a bite. <laughs> no promises. <laughs> oh, man. Do I have stuff all over my face? Oh, I do, totally. And the eggnog? Okay, don't eat it all, though. Okay, I'll have one more bite. Okay. Mm. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, so good, man. Dibs this one. I want this half. That's all you. We go out and forage Douglas fir tips in the what? spring, and then we freeze them, and then blitz it up with the sugar, and then again cook a pastry cream base and fold in uh, meringue and whipped cream at the end. The things that you have to go through to make the perfect cream puff. It's like too tall to fit. Oh, in. no, it's not. <laughs> Douglas fir. Whoa. 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 Yeah? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't think I've ever tasted anything like this before. Oh, okay. Well. But like the chocolate part. Oh, Douglas fir. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. No, I'm just kidding. It's amazing. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah, it's oh. weird because like you expect it kind of to be like matcha and then it's yeah. not at all. Um, this top layer, it's got like. Like little hints of things, like yeah, like hints of like a like a little mint, a little like citrusy flavor, nothing overpowering. It's a good like balance between them. These look crazy. Like this one is like triple chocolate threat. It's like dark chocolate, milk chocolate, white chocolate, and peppermint in it. And this one's got rum in it, so that's got my name written all over it. Rum? Yeah, eggnog and rum. Ooh. Um we have a lump of coal. Now this is a quarter of a lump. And I guess you were only a quarter naughty this year. That's, that's correct. We have a rum caramel layer, then the ganache, right? The second layer. The eggnog. Egg, egg, eggnog ganache in the second layer. And the final one is spice pecan and pop rock praline. Spice pecan. Spice pre, pre kit. We got it. <laughs> you know what's interesting about a chocolate like this is it kind of starts and you can kind of taste the separate layers, but then as you start working it around, they kind of all make, oh, the, oh, the, the crackling. <laughs> crackling by an open fire. Oh, you gotta try this around. Waiting for the crackle. I still got the crackle. You're right about the layers. Right? Yeah. You got it? Crackle! I always loved those as a kid. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Right? Oh, lumps of coal roasting on a coal filled fire. <laughs> it's the same thing. Yeah. If you're looking for treats to get for people for Christmas or for the holidays, you should definitely check this place out. They have like just an insane variety of things. And yeah, you're right. Like all of their chocolates have different stories. So it's not just like going to the supermarket and getting like, I don't know. Your run of the mill chocolates, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's a holiday, bitches. <laughs> okay, we got one stop left, and a good thing because I'm getting super full. Let's do this. Cue the Christmas music, part two. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Fucking radio doesn't work.
That's a jam. You are the Andrew Bernard of this office. I wish it was as cool as Andrew Bernard. <laughs> Just coming to this realization now. I'm such an Andy. Well, first of all, my name is Andrew. So perfect. So perfect. And I also also um, bebop and scat. <laughs> okay, last stop on our tour, we are at Shea Kristoff in Burnaby and we are going to learn how to make their new holiday snowman chocolate. Do you want to cook a snowman? Yes, I do. Yeah. Chocolate. And we're going to. And they're going to be delicious. Honestly, I don't think I'm going to be able to eat him after I make him. I think I'm, I'm just going to have to take a picture with it. It's probably true. Yeah. Mm, kill the snowman. Exactly, that's what they say, like, never eat your baby. <laughs> Can't eat your baby. No eating babies. <laughs> so let us back into the kitchen to see where the magic happens. Sure. A dream come true. <laughs> Look at all this chocolate. You want one of these for your house, Lauren? That'd be sweet. You just sit under it with your mouth <laughs> open. <laughs> Fresh, fresh chocolate. Oh, that cheers you. Okay. Ooh. Oh, yum. Who's the guy? Sven. Trademarked. Sven. <laughs> yeah. It's like crazy looking at all of like the bits of it and like, yep, you can eat that, you can eat that, you can eat that. Like this entire thing, you can eat all of it. So you're actually helping. Yeah. Okay. You're getting put to work. I show you one. A bit of chocolate. Mm -hmm. and then you put the first button. And the second one. And just push it like right in. Okay. Try? Okay. I put the chocolate, you wanna yes. No, I think it's better if you oh, do this because oh, otherwise no. we okay. have to Okay. More, more than that? That's fine? Yes, yeah, fine. Okay. Mm, push it in. I pushed. Perfect. There you go. See? Easy. <laughs> now do 150 of them. Ah, <laughs> oh, there it is. This is my jaw application. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Now for the nose. There you go. Thank you. You good? Ah, yeah! <laughs> Amazing. Elsa makes it look so easy. <laughs> That's right. Holiday chocolates. <laughs> I don't even say I'm so stuffed with chocolate. Mm. There, uh, it's the uh, time of year for chocolate. So. Exactly. Hope you enjoyed learning about all our favorite chocolate places in and around Vancouver. So now you know where to go to get gifts, or just like a little something, something for yourself. You know, sweet treats. <laughs> it's that time of year. Do it. Sweet treats happening all the times of the year, except for right now. You're rambling. Okay. <laughs> You're drunk, drunk on chocolate. <laughs> Chocolate! Thanks for watching the vlog. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you want to see more things to do in Vancouver during the holiday season. And we'll see you in the next video. Next vlogmas. Bye! Bye.